be showing you guys how I mix and master. I mix my tracks. So basically what I do is I start with my drums first and with the drums I start with the bass. So I'll be starting with the bass. So with the kick, I have a, a preset I've already saved. So I'll put that one on it. So this is how the preset look. This is how the, the, the EQ looks with the kick. So what I like doing with my hi-hats are, I, I usually pan them left and right so i use pancake pancake 2 which is a is a is a is a free plugin so with that one too i have a preset that i've saved which looks like this i i actually did one did this one by myself i i i, I chose the preset and i manipulated it and i got this So what I do with my open hearts is I, I put a um, stereo enhancer on it then I widen it but I I also reduce the stereo enhancer on the mixer channel to maybe 80% or 70 something. So with my pecs, I'll put a reverb on some and the, the reverb will not be that much. Then I'll leave the rest like that. So I'm done with the drums. So what I do after, after the drums and the bass is I go to the main instrument main chord progression of the beats which is the e piano now that I'm, I'm i'm going to work on so i'll solo it and listen to it if it has bass frequencies i'll cut it off if it doesn't i'll just leave it like that in the mix So I'll put a delay on it to like I don't know how, but I a delay will make it sound good. That's how I feel. So I'll go for fruity delay. Uh, so I'll put it on time and four, then this one to the far and cut the some of the high end. So it's okay now. So what I'll do is I'll put uh, I want I wanted to have a low five so so I'll put the uh, uh, S low five on it and I'll go to the preset then I'll go for set set drums and I'll lower it on the mixer.
So I'll go for an atmosphere which is the pad. So I'll also solo it. I'll give it a, a stereo enhancer, spread it, then reduce it. Let me solo some of the of the instrument so that my, my PC wouldn't be crashed. So what I normally do with the pad is I put a footy love filter on it so that um, it comes in and out and I'll, I'll, I have a preset here but basically what this preset is it's, it goes from a um, low filter to high filter it filters it low and high but it's automated so it goes and comes in So I'm, I'm, I'm working on the piano, the chopped one, and the picked one. So with the chopped piano, the bass is clashing, so I have to EQ. I have to EQ the bass section of the... So with the pitch piano, what I'll do is I'll, I'll also put the Fruity Love filter on it, but I'll copy it from the pad and place it on it so that it will also vary from low pass filter to you know high pass filter and all those, and all those things. So I will now be working with the sax, the chopped sax from saxophone. So it's, it's sounding good for me. I like the way it's sounding. So the next thing I'll be working with is the vocals. So I'll also solo that. Ah, so first thing first, I'll EQ. I'll EQ it. Put a fruity limiter on it contain it so then I'll put an auto tune on it um, but not too much So uh, I'll also put uh, the stereo announcer on it and a delay.
for this side. That one. That one. This one. Sounding okay, sounding okay. So I get rid of the vocal, then I'll come, I'll, I'll work on the guitar. So first things first, EQ. So what what I normally do is I EQ the low end of everything, everything. Then I go back and come back and you know do some editing. It's all about your ears. So a limiter to contain. Then a delay because basically it's sounding dry. Yeah, that's that's okay. This saxophone right here. So this this saxophone, what I'll do is I'll cut the low end and I'll put a reverb on it. I don't know if I should use the Valhalla reverb or you let me just use this reverb. So what I will do is I'll I'll go for the venue. to cut the low end of the reverb a little bit. So let's listen to all together. Thing left, which is the piano. And another piano. That's it. Everything is sounding. Everything is sounding good. Everything is in its place. So what I'll do now is with the arrangement. That's for another time. So with the arrangement, you take some things out. You put some things in place and all those stuff for you to get like to sound audible to the listener. So so it wouldn't be boring for the listener. So that's it. See you next time. <laughs>